Hello everybody and welcome to this tutorial series. I'm Angelo and I'm a 2D animator and motion designer. On today's tutorial we're going to learn how to create rain and after effects in under 2 minutes. We're going to drag our video into a new composition in After Effects and we're going to start on creating a new solid layer and we're going to go to layer, new, solid and set the color to black. We're going to set the blending mode of this layer to screen and after that we're going to go on to effects and presets and type CC Rainfall and we're going to drag that onto our solid layer. So we're going to play around with some of these settings here. With the drops, I'm going to go about 100. The size maybe around 15 should be good. For the speed, we're going to go to the maximum of that. So we're going to drag it all the way to the end until it reaches 20,000. And when we're going to go into the opposite position, negative maximum, which is negative 10,000. And variation. Set that around 8. Yeah. We're also going to add a Gaussian Blur effect to this solid layer. So go to the effects and presets and type Gaussian. That's the one right there. And we're going to drag that to a solid layer and maybe 20% blur, it's okay. But don't forget to check the repeat edges pixels. If we go ahead into our composition and play it back, we see that we have a nicely rain, but we're gonna try to make it more dramatic and add more effect to it so the rain is more random and not coming from a certain direction. So what are we gonna do is that we are going to duplicate our solid layer by hitting Ctrl D on our keyboard and go ahead and delete that Gaussian blur on the second layer. And we're gonna change the settings of the rain fold to give it more variations and drops set it about 300. Decrease the size maybe a little bit around 8. Maybe speed half of that should be good to 10,000. And wind a little more than half, so around. Yes, this should be good. Set the variations to 12 and increase the opacity to 50. So if we go back to our composition and play it back, we can see that we have a lot of more rain coming from here and a lot of directions and angles. So again guys, you can play as you want with the settings of this preset, but thank you for following till the end and make sure to hit the subscribe button and to follow the other tutorials. 